The Dalai Lama Center was started in 2005 after His Holiness's visit. He came here and his main focus of his talk was around how we need to balance education of the mind with education of the heart. Because in North America, of course, we focus so much on academic achievement sometimes to the detriment of social and emotional development. And so um, we are one of the only organizations um, co-founded by His Holiness, the only one in Canada or in the world doing exactly what we do. And that is focusing on educating the hearts of the children through Heart Mind Wellbeing. Heart Mind Wellbeing is exactly as it sounds. It's really about well-being in the mind and well-being in the heart. And the way the Dalai Lama Center thinks about heart, mind, well-being is through those five positive human qualities that live in that heart. We want children to be secure and calm, alert and engaged, to get along with others, to solve problems peacefully, and to be compassionate and kind. What you're able to do through heart, mind, well-being is find how to help develop children's social and emotional learning, building capacity not just in the children, but in the adults as well. So what's so critical here for the Dalai Lama Center to build the capacity, it's not only about giving the resources, but they're evidence-based resources. They're based on the latest science, and you could have access to that science as well. I felt that we really needed to look at uh, ways to help them deal with the stress of life, even at their young age, that they were facing. And the Heart Mind program seemed to provide a lot of resources that fit with the new core competencies, and social-emotional learning. One of the main benefits of the strategies that we have learned is creating a common language for us across all of our classrooms, so learning strategies that students can use at any age level, but then there's a continuity when they are in our school-wide community or out in our community of Maple Ridge around implementing and using strategies together because we have developed common language around it. What I love about the Dalai Lama Center is that everything is so current, like the, the, the latest things that are happening in research and neuroscience and what's, you know, heart, mind, compassion, it's, it's all there. The Dalai Lama Center has proven itself year after year as an incredible partner and advocate for children's well-being. And the Dalai Lama Center and its staff curate all of that on behalf of the best researchers in their field, so we knew that we had to go to the experts or those that had access to the most current and relevant information, and that's why we chose the Dalai Lama Center for Peace and Education. The work of the Dalai Lama Center for Peace and Education is so important right now in today's world because of the importance of educating the heart of all children. And the Dalai Lama Center for Peace and Education helps build that support of children and youth and focus on promoting their social and emotional learning through developing healthy relationships with the adults. So the Dalai Lama Center for Peace and Education really takes a system-wide approach, not just addressing the children or just the adults, but by addressing the entire context in which children grow and learn to help develop them to the greatest capacity. So we offer several resources for adults who have children in their lives. Firstly, we have an online resource which allows us to have national and international reach and it's called HeartMind Online. And it's free resources for anyone who wants them um, to access and to use in their work with children. We also have a conference that we have uh, done since 2013 which brings together academics with the latest research around a theme relating to heart, mind, well-being. And we also have workshops. We've developed a full suite of workshops. There is a foundational heart, mind, well-being workshop that's half day and allows people to really understand what is the concept of heart, mind, well-being, why is it so important, what's the research behind it, but most importantly, how can I activate that in my life with children? We used to think that people are either born kind or not, or they're born with the type of personality where they can get along with others or not. But we now know that we really do learn those things. We learn them from watching others. We learn them by being taught explicitly. And the work of the Dalai Lama Center really is taking note of that and creating resources for schools and for communities where we can create environments, where we can develop relationships with children so that they develop those positive human qualities and they have happier and healthier lives and more well-being. We are capacity builders. So we work with adults who have children, whether they're parents or educators at all levels or mental health professionals or counselors. 